outside. Good morning guys, this is Ranger Rob from the Ranger Rob Country Living. And uh, today's going to be an interesting day. Supposedly our pellet stove comes in today, so that'll be interesting. A uh, couple of notes. Um, first of all, it's a beautiful day today for winter. It's still cold. Still got to work on the pond a little bit here. <coughs> But uh, yeah, at least it's running pretty good. So the stuff that went on, just the stuff that went on. First of all, it's, it it feels depressing because I feel like everything was set back. But uh, I think it's getting to a point where so so many people are frustrated enough that uh, all their normal means of of uh, airing their concerns keep being taken away so they're pushing people to the extreme but uh i think i want to pass on some advice i heard um it's really nice out here it's real pretty anyway uh <clears throat> i think it was a canadian prepper i heard i think where they said you know this stuff was really getting under, under everybody's skin the next four years are going to be amazing, amazingly crazy. <laughs> We're going to see policies and payments and taxes and things that probably uh, aren't going to be very pleasant. But one thing, uh, the advice I heard was <clears throat> that all this garbage we hear about, the news, the politics, the issues, uh, travel bans, etc., it's about 10% of our lives that we just have to get frustrated with. <clears throat> but the other 90%, you control. You control the happiness of having a good home, happiness of a good meal, the happiness of working in your yard, um, being self-sufficient, um, the happiness of a crazy dog. You know what I mean? You control that. And uh, that's a lot. And all of us have got to put up with a 10% every day of the crap we got to put up with. Um, I know I'm frustrated. I've got to shut off the news. <laughs> I mean, even more. Um, even uh, some of the business, some of the things that I was in, um, were getting under my skin. And... Uh, uh, no more, no more. My focus is going to be more of the homestead, a good meal, uh, working on things that are already profitable, and uh, it's all frosty. <laughs> Squirrel, <laughs> you get frost on top of the, and it's like you can tell that's the shady part of the property, and uh, to turn all this what looks really blah right now and gray and brown uh, all this is gonna come to life pretty soon it's months away and uh, so I'm gonna worry about 90% of my life the other 10% just gonna do my part deal with it and turn it off I hope you guys do the same thing I know a lot of us are just so tied up in this crap and it'll never go away. And just because our regime is changing, there'll be a whole new set of garbage. And uh, so be it, I guess. But the, the big part is worrying about today, worrying about being happy, taking care of our properties, um, doing things with our kids, having fun with our animals, um, growing our own food, a garden those are your 90% of things that are enjoyable hard hard work um, gives you a sense of resolve and uh, that's what I need to start focusing on too because um, <laughs> it's almost depressing right now with all this stuff I don't even want to turn on the television and uh, the Hallmark channel is looking so much better than it ever did before <laughs> 
So, uh, anyway, today we should have a pellet stove coming in. Um, yesterday, by the way, um, I showed I was getting eggs. I actually got five eggs. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, the egg production is definitely up a little bit. So, uh, anyway, one of these days also I thought, I'd, I don't know if you see in the back of my property back here, is we have a gate. And I've never actually taken you to the other parts of the property, which go beyond these fences. It's uh, definitely barren. Um, it can be brought to life if we decide to bring in a, a bigger critter. Uh, we have been working on the designs of the new uh, rabbit hutches. Um, and uh, we are going to, even though we want the gathered... Uh, the rabbits droppings for our garden and stuff we also want our ha rabbits to be very happy so we're doing a transition kind of cage which they will be above ground and we will be able to capture a lot of their droppings uh, the other thing is uh, we're gonna allow them to be able to get out to to an open area and act like rabbits um, and I just think that's important you're going to have an animal um, you should give it the best life possible and the other thing I was going to tell you is yesterday I did manage to uh, pick up the rest of my lumber for all the trim stuff we need for the wiggle wire and yes <laughs> so let's uh I got back here another $75 worth of lumber along with another 160 here uh, lumber is really getting this is costly. So those of you that know how to refurbish wood from old barns and stuff, <laughs> thumbs up to you. <laughs> and uh, um, I always have such happy dogs. So anyway guys, I did actually get the pool uh, emptied out and turned over. That's what the, um, kept freezing and was getting a little, <laughs> a little grody. We'll wait for the weather to get nice again before we start using the pool for the dogs again. And uh, that's all I have for this part of the video. The next part hopefully is showing you the installation of uh, <clears throat> the new pellet stove. And uh, you gotta remember I live in Central Oregon. And everything here operates in Central Oregon time, which is uh, whenever. <laughs> so it will be whatever they get here is when it's going to go in so we'll, we'll deal with that so let's move on well that's all i have for this video i actually am going to i have a follow-up video after this it's actually going to be the same day uh, our pellet stove did come in but there was some drama kind of pretty out here today so anyway i want to thank you for watching please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world really share it that really helps us so guys uh have a great day and be safe. Bye now. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.